No, I see not really because the thing is about Coach Smart and Coach what Coach Pim used to do, he always used to rotate because you never know when is your last play. So I, I always practice with Kate May at left tackle a few periods. I always practice with Jamar at right tackle a few periods and everything like that. So and Warren coming in, substituting at different plays. So it's not really too much of that because you never know. Coach Pittman always, 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 always told us that. Like, you never know. And Coach Luke is like that just as well. And so is Coach Martin. So we always want to be what if, what if, what if. So if we got that what if part out of it, it won't be no problem. Solomon, how, how much healthier are you now than you were? It looked like you played with a bang at that yeah. ankle all season. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Um, I'm pretty much getting back to almost healthy. Just stay in the training room, trying to get as much fit and as much healthy as I can. Um, I'm not all the way 100%, but I'm trying to get there. If you dropped a little bit of the weight back, yeah, I know yeah. for a big guy like yeah, you, it's easy yeah. to put it on. Yeah, most definitely. Uh, Coach, Coach Sinclair, I, uh, script edition coach, and Coach Smart, I do cardio after every practice and stuff just to get a little extra run in, try to lose a few more after practice and everything, get a little extra sweat. Yeah, I know you, you're a Pokeball guy, so I, I, know you do try and, I know you do try and eat healthy. Is the, is the recruiting started with Coach Luke? I mean, you're obviously one of those guys yeah. that people look at. I mean, as he said, I'm, look, hey, big guy, come back and yeah. win an Allen yeah. Trophy. I mean, uh, I, I don't it's, that's not really uh, a thing that we're talking about right now because we're focused on the Sugar Bowl and we want to we win the Sugar Bowl for these people that have no choice but to leave like Charlie Warner, uh, Rodrigo, David Marshall, all those guys. So that's not really a question. I just want to win this game for my, for my brothers. No doubt. And, and what about Luke? I mean, you, you, you've only worked with him 11 practices, but what has he brought? What have you gained from him already? Um, what I gained from him is it's just it's, it's like a lot of stuff. A lot of stuff I, I gained from him is um, good techniques, things like different hand punches on pass pro. And not only that, he comes to practice no matter what. The 11, all these, every 11 practice, every single one of them, he came to practice with great energy, great enthusiasm. He came ready to play, like as he was playing a game on the first. So that's what I really love about Coach Luke. One of the biggest upsets last year, what wasn't just Texas beating you guys, yeah. but they beat you in the trenches. Okay. And all the offensive linemen, you know, you, you, Andrew, everybody said, yeah, that was not our best. This group that you've got now missing three starters and what you're up against, what's what's the mindset and how much is of a motivator is what happened with Texas last year? No doubt that's a motivator for us. Um, that's what the world is saying. Uh, Texas beat you guys up front last year, how you guys are going to respond, and then Andrew and Isaiah going. Um, I wish the best of luck for both of them boys because those are my brothers. I love both of them. But um, we just the next person up mentality, next person up mentality, and K Jamari, a Warren, they're going to do their best to produce as a good as good as well. I know as I know as I know they can because and you're kind of the guy now. You're yeah. the leader. I mean, yeah. Andrew's gone. I mean, you're you're mm -hmm. you're the old guy on the line. I yeah, mean, I what's you. that been like for you to lead that room? It just look, you know, like I've been leading the room almost all year. Me and Drew and Isaiah, we always we all have led the room since the beginning of the beginning of the season. So it's nothing new. We know. It's nothing new. We know that. What I know what I have to do. I know what I have, how I have to lead. I know how I have to play for my brothers to come along with me because I know I'm the ring bearer because, like you said, Andrew and them are, are gone. So I just know I have to do a little bit more for them to know that it was all right. My last question, now that Drew's gone, who's going to keep you calm? Can you, you, you get a little laundry <laughs> <Yeah>. out there. <laughs> that is a good question because Kay Mays, you can get – because Kay ain't going to hold me back. Kay going to go right go on right on with me. So I guess I just got to cool down and just chill out. So, yeah, I'll be straight. What was that conversation like with uh, Isaiah? 